And we begin with Casey Nolan at Soldan High School in St. Louis. Casey? Art, there's still a lot going on out here. We're on Union Boulevard, a little north of Forest Park Parkway. Soledan is kind of behind us. That's where the scrimmage was going on between several public high schools when this all started there, but then the action moved here and the focus is on this little restaurant you see there where police are still investigating. There are a lot of police officers still here and there's a crowd that is at the very least shaken up, if not a little stunned and on edge. Let's show you the video from what it looked like when our crews first got here around 845. This started earlier, so maybe a little closer to eight. There are a lot of stories going around out here and a lot of them don't match up. So we'll just stick with what we have been able to track down and confirm through authorities. But one thing we can tell you as firsthand information, when our crew got here, we heard at least 10 gunshots still going off after police were already here trying to control the situation. What we know is that three teenagers, this is coming from the fire department, three teenagers were hit by gunfire and once again, a child, we're told seven years old, was also hit. The conditions are not exactly clear, but from the fire department's perspective, we're told it's not great. Critical is the word they're using. They're gonna be at the hospital, we're gonna get more information from a medical perspective there, but the firefighters are telling us they're at the very least in serious condition, if not worse. We were also able to speak to a student and a parent who were here for those football games who told us fighting broke out. And after that, it wasn't long until the gunshots, gunshots started flying. Let's take a listen to what they had to say. People were leaving as they were exiting everything. Started with kids fighting in both sides of the exits. And um, I tried to round up my kids and get them to the car as quickly as possible. There were several fights uh, in front of me, to the sides of me. There was police um, breaking up some of the fights, um, pepper spray, people being choked, hair getting pulled out. Again, as we were saying, people around here just after, well, frankly, after a summer like we've had involving children and violence, you get the sense from people talking to them that they're just kind of just kind of shocked, just kind of stunned as they watch police investigate this scene. Again, what we know, four people hit by gunfire at this point. That's been confirmed through the fire department. They tell us three of them were teenagers and one was a child, possibly a seven-year-old. We're working to figure out, Art, uh, what are all these other stories? Where, where do they line up in the parts that are true and accurate? We will bring that to you if we get more information. But for now, we'll send it back to the studio from a very still active scene uh, here not far from Soldan High School. Art. Casey, thank you very much.